Hey everybody, big news over the weekend, there were 35 new connectors released to Power Automate, which is huge. We haven't seen a new connector yet in 2022. So it's really exciting to dive in and check it out. But um, I guess a little surprise that we're starting to see some, I don't know, different types of independent publisher connectors popping up that, you know, the first few were, were all in fun. I did a review about the Chuck Norris one and the dad jokes. They made me giggle. I thought it was funny because we haven't seen anything like this in the connector space. Um, but there's there's more. There's new ones that are popping up, like Star Wars, like get all the Star Wars ships, which, all right, we're, we're like funny with our connectors, but it makes me wonder if these connectors are like polluting the Power Automate connector space. So... Just some weird thoughts, right? Like, what are we gonna do with, with these connectors? And are they kind of mucking up the traditional connectors that we've been seeing in Power Automate? They're funny, they make us laugh, but I don't know, are they useful? <laughs> are they useful in your business? Are they useful in automating different things or are they simply a distraction? That said. I still love my Chuck Norris one. I think it's hilarious to get a Chuck Norris or a dad joke. Um, so I see the benefit in some of these. I just wonder at what point do they become too many? At what point does it distract us from the automations that help our users simplify their work stream? Um, and and when, when does Microsoft say, all right, enough is enough with these connectors. We want to stay productivity focused, business focused. I don't know, we'll see.